Good evening everybody. Here's another one. Let's see what we've got in the box this time. Okay. This time we have... Okay, doesn't really say what the model number is here, apart from the fact it's one of the UV range. Okay, that's not... Okay, that... There's no English at all in here. Interesting. Let's put that there. Okay, what have we got? We've got the usual, We've got the cable clip. And we have. Oh, it's one of those in here microphone type things. Pretending to be Secret Service or whatever. Let's put it there. The charging unit. And the antenna, it's just the usual dual band antenna battery. <clears throat> and it's BL UV28, that's just for the battery. Yeah, 2000 milliamps, 7.4 watt of volts. Okay, let's just put that there for a second. And the actual radio itself. Oh no, there we go. And there's the lanyard or whatever you want to call it, lanyard or whatever. And the radio itself. Nothing more on there, so let's get rid of this box. Okay, so the radio. is Bofeng UV28, 5 watts, looks like it's just a dual band this one. So the UV28L. Okay, so it's seem to go on with the big button format again for the old sausage fingers. Not as big as the 25 though, UV25. Okay, three buttons there, the PTT, and what's this we have? Oh yeah, there's a standard K plug for programming. Okay, let's fire it up, turn it on, see if there's any difference in the hardware. I have a sneaky suspicion there's probably not, but let's try it anyway. Okay. Welcome. Frequency mode. Okay, this. Okay, this looks very similar. Looks like it's a standard for the UV range at the minute. Yeah, that switches between the A and B. Nothing there. The up and down do. Yep. Just frequency. Channel mode. Oh, frequency and channel frequency mode. mode. Channel okay. Mode. Menu. Oh god, it's that red menu again. What are they playing at? Scratch. Let's go back. Okay, let's go the other way to see if it's the same firmware as the uh, previous ones. Uh, looks like it. It's probably got to stop. Yep, there it is, the stopwatch. So... Confirm. Yeah, the stopwatch. So. <laughs> Why? I've got no idea. Menu. So, it looks as though this radio is just like the rest of the recent ones from the UV... Oh, where is it? Uh, the UV25 or whatever it was, or earlier. Seems to be pretty much the same settings, the same horrible red background with the very useful, very useful not stopwatch. But 
This was sold to me as a 5 watt radio this time, not like the previous one which was a UV29. And that was sold to me as a 10 watt radio. So, maybe it's the, um, maybe it's the transmitting side of it. I don't know, we'll soon find out. But yeah, this is the UV28. Or the UV28L to be exact in this particular case. And uh, looks pretty much like the other ones. But I will do a power test and programming and all that sort of stuff in a later video. Anyway, so there you go. The UV28. Another big one with the old big keys for the sausage fingers. Okay, next video coming up when I get a chance to do it. Probably in a couple of days. Have a good evening everybody. Seven threes.